two of uh, the, the Toronto Elemental Championship from Sword and Board Games uh, at Bloor and Dufferin. Uh, I'm joined by Sung Ho today. Hello, everyone. We have uh, Ben on the right playing Unicorn, and we have Zach on the left uh, playing Phoenix, uh, abandoning his long-term love for Scorpion. Uh, I, I think he believes that Scorpion is not as competitively viable anymore, uh, so he's looking to find uh, what the next big deck is. Well, um, it's probably because of a lot of the cards that got to the restricted list and just kind of, you know, I think Scorpion got at least four cards, I believe, in the... Uh, yeah, so they have... Um, Fate Wars and Death, Four g -Dig, Young Rumonger, and... Those are only three that they have, but it'll yeah. impact with other things that they like yes. to play in their deck. Yes. Uh, I'm just trying to think, am I, am I missing one? No, I'm not, I don't think so. Yeah. I mean, obviously other clans also got hit pretty bad too, with yeah. uh, Dragon, with uh, Boy Fist, um, rewording on Hawk Tattoo as well. Right. Things like that. And I, and I believe that Ben is playing uh, a, very close to the list that uh, Frotop put a video about. Recently, his Rapid Dash Unicorn deck. Gotcha. Um, so, uh, yeah, I mean, we could probably do a quick preview here of. Well, we had the ver. Actually, we have the deck list. We're not gonna. I'm not gonna worry about bringing them up on screen quite yet. But we'll uh, show you the cards as they revealed. So, getting right into it here with a political Earth conflict uh, at one Ooh, of Ben's wow. provinces. So reveals upholding authority. Uh, so that's that prodigy of the waves. Clarity, so he's going to be able to do a lot of work this round. Good province to hit pretty early. Uh, yeah, no defenders, lets it go. Applies the upholding authority to discard uh, some cards from his hand. Looks like he's going to target those two. Th considering those two favor uh, Finger of Jades. I don't think that's a big impact, but... I don't think so. But well, I mean, I mean I two cards is better than yeah. one, right? I mean, I don't know if uh, Ben's deck list has endless plane in it. Endless planes in it? No, it probably does not. not. But that would have been a very good reason to get rid of. No, but it's the um, player chooses. It's oh, not, they player chooses. You're right. Yeah, it's not a target. So probably. With Ben here, he might want to do either Void first or some sort of uh, talk with that. He's going somewhere wow. with that Border okay. Rider. Okay, call, call shot going for Void. Oh, wait, no, nope, never mind. Fire, okay. Wait, I think he was saying, like, well, I'm not going to give you water, it's not going to do me any good. I'm not going to give you Void because that's another... You'll get the fate back. That's right, yeah. So, uh, two against... I don't know yet. I doubt he's going to defend here because it means he can't attack again. <coughs> and he has no... Well, I mean, does he have an against the waves to potentially ready? I don't think he drew it yet, but he might draw for this one. All right. so. Looks like he drew a let go. Yeah. Charge seems pretty good. Seems awkward. You kind of want to attack water, but then you kind of don't want to attack water. <laughs> So it looks like Ben is, wants to invest in this break. So five against uh, three. Oh, did he declare, did he declare the defender? <clears throat> he did. Okay. All right. Just these are like that. Dishonors. Yep. He's able to trigger his... Uh, I don't Keep think he will, though. Oh, no, no. I don't think he'll trigger the the stronghold. So, he'll leave it at that. But probably the best bet would just be to ready the border rider and then uh, do a political attack. Yeah. 
Well, he's second player. He could potentially go water because he's got a Nino in his hand. Yeah, it's just um, I don't know good. if Zach wants to pressure for the Imperial favor because then <clears throat> he'll definitely win that. That is also true. You're right. I mean, not necessarily if you leave the uh, the keeper back. That's right. Yeah. So he's just gonna go with a little poke just to uh, steal and make him dishonored, or not dishonored, but no. But he's uh, gonna get the Kudaka trigger. Kudaka trigger and start small honor pressure. So pretty clean, um, pretty clean turn one. Pretty quick. It's gonna take the military favor. Seems fitting, considering it's a. Huh. So Ben should be going to twelve, and Zach going to nine. Oh yeah, right, because of the embrace the void. Yeah. So Zach holds on to the Suki and the Forgotten Library. Ben has a whole new flop. Very interesting. Uh, Ben's deck having against the waves. Uh, another card that also just recently got out of restricted list. So that's pretty cool. Uh, obviously, Ben's restricted card is Charge. Yes. Uh, I don't think we've seen Zach's yet. I'm going to take a guess, and probably it's, um... Tadaka? Yeah. 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 I think that's probably a fair thing. Zachary plays a uh, single with one fate. Fist. But I don't know how many monks... No, I don't think I don't think it's a, yeah. there's enough targets. Yeah. You'd have to play some really marginal characters to have enough uh, monks. Right. Also, you'd also have to play uh, <laughs> Seal of the Dragon. Uh, so, Finger of Jade on Shahai. Going to get instantly cloud minded Looking at two Fate each, probably. Two Honor each. Okay. Interesting. Oh, too bad that Kadaha didn't stick around from before. Oh, interesting. That's so, uh, I don't know what Zach just declared with the... Um, Oh, the Elemental Dreamer? Dreamer. Yeah. But I would imagine it's one of the rings with fate on it. But well, I don't know which one. I'm guessing the water ring, just because the water ring is probably going to happen at some point. Yeah. I think it would have been... Okay. If, if Ben's deciding to attack Fertile Field, <coughs> there's no need to play the... Wayfinder to, to see what another province would yeah. be. So three strength on Ben's side. Triggers a fertile field, draws a card. So it looks like it's defending with Elemental Dreamer. What's uh, it Looks like it's defending with Elemental Dreamer. Sorry. Yeah. But it chooses an element. But I uh, cannot response tell. another Ben's bonsai back and forth. Yep. So I don't know which uh, one it is. Victor is going to go check and see if he has the, the bonus this round. It's uh, Shugenja Void, right? The uh, Ethereal Dreamer. It's a uh, subtype. Sorry, it's on what? It's on Void. It's on Void, okay. So it is 7-7. Seven so, seven. Yep. Uh, <laughs> Not really different than the 7-5 here until yeah. uh, something else happens. 
Honestly, I'm a bit surprised that the spy guys didn't end up on Shahai before this. How did he gain a fate? Hmm. Okay. Do we charge one of these? Uh... I think I think he may have paid a fate for his bonsai. Oh, I see. Okay. Void is the dreamer, so she'll be leaving this round. Very impressed with that dreamer. The dreamer is an amazing card. Yeah. Just a, a lot of value. <coughs> Excuse me. 100% Zach's going to attack with water. But what province is a good question. There'll just be Ninos coming left and right. <laughs> Potentially. I mean, the Ninos may make, not make enough of a difference for Ben. He may hold them back. Yep, here we go. Political water. Both, it looks like. Hits meditations. Looks like both. Might be concerned about... Uh, against the waves being used against him. That's true. Early cloud the mind. Oh. <coughs> So it looks like it's uh Oh, it's actually um, three to one because the Keeper of the Waves is uh, Dishonored. Keeper of the Waves is Dishonored? Yeah, because uh, Ben did a Fire Ring. Oh, uh, it's a Prodigy, you mean? Prodigy, yeah. So we're going back to five. Oh. Wait. Okay. There we go. Probably Ben. Oh, was that a, Probably going to show up. Sure. Yeah. This is a pretty good province to not lose. Yeah, so. you might, there's no reason to lose it for nothing. <clears throat> See a fan coming out? I'm surprised Zach hasn't done a clarity purpose right away. He's dishonored. So against the waves, <clears throat> bows the prodigy. So that's five gone, or three gone. Yep. So Zach's still winning. Yeah, I'm surprised Zach didn't fire off the clarity purpose right away. But. I mean, he may want... He's being cautious. He doesn't have a lot of money. Three feet still pretty good. Yeah. That's why he didn't mind. That's also it's like a, such a battle of attrition, too, when, like, you, know, you, can, you can bow it, but then they can just bow their stronghold to do get up again. <laughs> Looks like Ben is considering playing the gin he has in his hand. I think you want to play the Iuchi first if you're going to be doing something like that. You could I mean, also it, talisman. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter if you're tied or if you lose by three in this particular for this particular province. All right. Reveals, no problem to see. Yeah, reveals the meditations. Sorry, that yeah, nine of four. Now we'll see the gin. So we're, we're nine together, nine. everyone. Yep. <clears throat> Not really a lot of options that are available here to to win in the conflict at this point. Beyond bowing out characters, but you, you got to get rid of two. It's yeah. All right. Right. Can't do anything with the ring, so that's fine. He can, he can ready his dreamer. Yeah. He's going to react and, and uh, honor Asuki. 
those are so not great tokens on camera. Because like the Dishonored and Honored look pretty much the same. Yeah. Some. They're both shuffling in their fishmen. I'm guessing Ben's probably going to ready up. Uh, I I don't know that character's name. Shahai? Shahai, yeah. Ichi Shahai? Yeah. Or no, is it the Ichi? Yeah, it's the Ichi Shahai. Okay. Probably look for something like um, political. Oh, Having gone through two of the. Oh, yeah. Let's go the Cloud the Mine, so yeah. Prodigy's going to be able to ready as well. He. Zach does have all three, so that's a pretty good. Uh, <coughs> oh man! Unfortunately, Ben only has this political conflict to declare. <laughs> yeah, and that prodigy is a big boy or big person. I guess, well, I mean, I still want to put the, the Spyglass as a potential target for uh, the Leko. Mm -hmm. He doesn't know that Zack has since drawn a whole bunch more. That's right. Uh, but I, I realize that's probably why he was reluctant to play it at the beginning of the round. Looks like going to the end of the round here. Zach's deciding which side of the favor he wants. Good choice. Military. Ops to let all those characters die. So I'm thinking... <coughs> I don't know how good these uh, sh the Shigenja water are in this uh, type of game. Yeah, off to toss them out. Interesting. Still keeps Sudaga. Still, still a decent character. Not a bad body. It was pretty when he has a charge. Okay. Ooh. That's a rough flop after deciding to hold on to that Mystic. Yeah. For Zach. Look, guy, Master of Guys Toshi's uh, pretty good. Brings her to play with three fate. Probably going to pass straight after as well. Yeah. So. Oh, we got a we got a, we got a card read. The one time when you kind of want to see multiple cavalry, but we only see two. Two honor to each player. Moto see the Moto Youth come out. Yeah. It's probably going to pass after that. Well, it's a good thing that Shihai is a unique character. You know, ben probably doesn't know that uh, Carbic Twist is lying in the background. Wow, consume, okay. So what do you think uh attack's gonna declare for the uh Geist? Uh I'm gonna say either either fire or earth. One of those two sounds like a good idea. So, 
probably opt to either put Spyglass or something so that uh, can get some cards in. So that's probably going to respond with a... Uh, like, though? No, I don't Maybe. think... Uh, I mean, you still may want to hold on to them uh, for clouds. Yeah. Particularly when you know you're facing a unicorn deck that's going to be Shigenja heavy. So, as a good guess, they're going fire. Matsuki, yep. Well, no fade, so that's pretty good. So, four. Uh, four? Four, yeah. yeah. I was double checking the, fate, uh, the favor. And then defending with Shahai going to five. I guess we'll all to pass because he's winning, so it's fine. Wow. He's got the third fan to play on Suki. So going to six. And then... Embrace the Void, okay. Starting to mooch out his characters. Oof. Okay. The Embrace Consume is just so good. A two-cost Consume is... Yeah. So he gets the three fate off of uh, Shahai. Still winning the conflict as well. I don't know. Uh, just, I, don't, I, don't think I don't. I don't. I don't think you commit any more resources to this. I don't even. I don't even know if he has any more. Like beyond playing the other spyglass and the talisman. I, yeah. Then you're like, oh, but you're just one. Uh, Back at home. Here we go. Nope. Nope. One. Maybe one. <clears throat> yeah. Supernatural storm. I guess is maybe what he's positioned for there. So you get the break. Would you clarity, Suki? No, right? You just let it... No, that's not, that's not that important. You're probably going to declare a, uh, a water conflict. So having someone to ready there is... You're getting the secondary effect off of it. Yep. So it looks like this lone youth is going to attack. Meditations. Yep. All we defend with... So two strengths. Going in with four. Oh, she went in with five. Oh, sorry, I forgot. I missed that. They got honored. All right, here we go. We're going up to seven against five. Yep. Seems pretty good. Gonna go with the Cavalry Reserve. Interesting. I wonder if Zach has any... He doesn't have any centuries. Okay, so he just... <laughs> Brings out uh, two Masters. All right, one sec. Two Masters of Swift Waves? Yeah. Four characters to two, so he probably. Uh, it looks like he, one of them. It looks like he swapped uh, one of the riders with uh, Shahai. Yeah. To get another card with uh, Spyglass. Uh, well, just so that he had an unbowed character back at base.
I think he's checking to see if there's actually cavalry on the... On, on which? Oh, I think he's just trying to determine if switching counts as a move. So bring up uh, the master. So choose a participating, switch to chosen cards locations. Does that ca try count as a move? Does that trigger a spyglass? Uh, I don't think, I don't believe that it does. It's not a move. Looks like he's going to trigger the action. Oh no. On Shinjo Shono? And Shinjo Shono? Oh no, the pride, just pride for Shinjo Shono. Just what? Pride? The pride is fired. So Shinjo ends up honored. What, Such sadness. What happened? He, he's uh, using his stronghold to. Uh, oh, su <laughs> Supuku it and then. Uh, Oh. Oh, that's a good hit. Caught the mine? That is a good hit. I mean, even though he did not get the uh, spyglass trigger, I think it is still valuable that. Well, then you have another he, character. You have another character. Yeah, exactly. I mean, well, this will probably force Zach to attack with water to try to defend with. Uh, the new guy? <laughs> Sorry, well, the, the store is getting even more invaded. We're trying to clear some space for more players. I think it's what they do on their Sunday events or something. Yeah. Military water, as I expected, of attacking. Yeah, might as well defend. Uh, it's not bad. So let's go. He didn't use uh, meditations. Interesting. Was this a second? This is a second attack this turn, though. Yeah, but he didn't trigger the first round. Yeah, but he chose uh, not to attack with it. I think he just missed it. Okay. Looks like it's they're going to end round here. Oh man, look at all these people leaving. Yeah, it's not not a great look for Ben here. Giving Zach some of his cards back. <laughs> At least he doesn't have to worry about that. Well, I mean, I don't know that uh, Zach had more than the one consumed by fire. Well, he actually has it in his discard. He doesn't have to worry about the consumed into an embrace the void. That's true. That's true. This is funny. It might be even good for Zach. Just buying a non-unique character and just karmic twisting it onto Prodigy of the Waves. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, I assume that will happen. I mean, worst case, it's the Mystic. Solemn Scholar. That's pretty good. You just pay a really cheap guy and then... Uh, you can do it with the Mystic too, right? Yeah. Because you care even less After about the Mystic. you survivor. use the... Yeah. Yeah, that's true. I mean, if he has a twist. I don't know if he has a twist, but... No, I think I saw it in Zach's hand a while ago. Oh, he's, he's got it in his discard. That's all he needs. Oh, yeah. Another copy of Shinjo Shono. And rests two fade into it. Yeah, you kind of need to now recoup on getting some characters up. Wow, only choose about one fade on the Song Scholar. 
Maybe he doesn't want to do the uh, the plan that we were thinking of. I mean, at that point, I would have been maybe tempted to go for fate and to rebuild my board a little bit. Yeah. Uh, Zach's already got an enormous pile. You're not putting him that much farther ahead. I still haven't seen Zach's restricted card yet, but I think it's uh See a spyglass on Shono. May see this one get uh, let go, I think. Yeah, because there's no Shugenja in play, so at least Zach doesn't have to worry about... I mean, there's always the Wayfinders that can give you the capability. But he still has a, his last let go, even after he uses one more. Very interesting. Uh, I just took a look at Zach's um, influence for his deck, and Alecos are the only uh, uh, dragon card. Yes. yes. Offside, uh, the other cards are just not that important. I mean, it's hard not to take spells. Like, you're going to be sacrificing really good Phoenix cards you want for dragon cards yes. that are not kind of core to what you're trying to accomplish. Yep. I get that. Oh, let's go to the supply glass. Oh, he's got a third supply glass as well. I mean, he could come back with another. Depends what he wants to be able to spend his money on. He's got an uphill climb here. I gotta be honest, I'm really surprised with that pile of fate. Uh, I mean, I guess uh, Zach probably has a conflict character that he can do his karmic twist with as well. That's cool. Yeah, that so could he didn't be have to do too. it with the dynasty. Yeah. Obviously, if he's got a shrine maiden in his hand, that is a perfectly reasonably reasonable target. So we're looking at seven to whatever oh. Zach defends with. I think Ninos are his only conflict character, so. Yeah. Why well, the moment? Um. So, Supernatural or no, let's draw a car first. Yeah. Is that his full play set of uh, Ninos? It is. So we're going to nine for Ben, but then Seven, uh, eight. Zach goes to eight. <laughs> so we're going to 13. I think he's putting both of those on Shono. Yeah. As unfortunate as it is, because, uh, yeah. I'm gonna let go of the finger. <laughs> Play another finger. Let go it again, I think. Oh, it is. Okay. Yeah, wow. Okay. What does he? What did he want to do to Shono? Kanjo district. Did. Oh, Kanjo. Sorry, you're right. Never mind. Duh. Yeah, I think was that. Uh, I get it. You don't want to give. Bank cards, but yeah. So we're gonna supernatural to go to eleven. There's sword. To Fifteen. The the sword is the word. Swords everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. You can play. Uh, uh, you can play each wayfinder to uh, add another character so that uh, Shono can uh, activate. More swords. He's gonna he's gonna can draw him. Okay. That's fine. Thank you. So thirteen to twelve, still winning. 
So Pride gets to honor uh, Shono. I wonder what my master chose for the um, spells. Uh, all I know is that it was not air. Yes. Good call. Good call. Good call. Maybe it was water. Let's go to a new province. Shameful. All right. Well, Manker is fine. It's gonna faint. So four breaking, which sucks. So, he uh, he did use water for his uh, master, because he tried to play a captive audience, and it was not a spell, so could do it. It didn't happen. But he can't even play it, though. So why oh. would he still lose it on it? Never mind. So it did happen? It did happen, so I guess, why would he have, I don't know what they were pointing at. Okay. Okay. What are we ready? Uh, prodigy? Well, scholar uh, maybe, because you're going to maybe use the prodigy ability. Yeah. Yep, ready the prodigy as well. Yeah, Astra and now. Uh, Astra, yeah, sure. Please do share it on Discord. Uh, usually we don't stream at a venue when they don't have a wired connection just because we've had problems in the past. Um, but we, the, the Wi Fi signal seems pretty strong. It seems like it's been pretty stable, so. <laughs> Go! <laughs> uh, you can. <clears throat> You can post the, uh, the the Lotus Pavilion link as well. Unfortunately, we only ended up with 10 players today. Uh, which is the right number we need. So, Which is enough. Uh, unfortunately, Asmine Canada still hadn't shipped out uh, the prize kit by the beginning of the week. So we weren't sure if we were going to have to reschedule or not. Right. So some of the, the marketing uh, that we would have liked to have done, we were holding off on. So... We're going to shameful. Oh, what is this? So, uh, filling the fortress. So it's like the void plus two. So when it's broken, you can put a character ah. into play from one of your provinces. Interesting. Okay. Who's attacking? Uh, Prodigy and Song Scholar. So an attack of six. You got a charge happening? No. No. Oh, no, sorry. That was the, the, that was the trigger. But. Yo. <laughs> Uh, 
Okay. Well, at least we know what province we're not going to go into. Yeah. I mean, although, are you really worried about giving him more fate? No, no, no. Uh, oh, you're not going to go to Shameful, yeah. Yeah. Or you are? Well, there's only one. No, okay. Oh, I'll hold it. Oh, yeah. Sorry, right. Oh, wow. No, no, no. I see the, I see the stronghold now, or the province in the stronghold. Yes, yeah. I mean, if, if this is the way that it's gone so far, there's probably another Void Province in this deck. No, no, no. Um, I didn't know which Void Province it was. No, no, no. I, that's, yes, I was uh, alluding to it being that oh, one. Oh, yes. Uh, so, obviously, yes, the Phoenix uh, Kaito... Kaito Mori? Kuromori. Kuromori. Nice. Okay. Let's try to break it. Ow. Jin. Unleash the Jin. Mean. Ah, uh, well, 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 I didn't know if I'd bother. Right? Bother with what? Well, uh, oh, like fighting more on it? Yeah, I, w I would just. Uh... No, because. Oh, why? Why? Oh, he'd already used his province. Okay, never mind. That's why. I was like, I thought he hadn't. I hadn't realized that he'd already used the province. I thought oh, he could yes. just use yes. against the waves from his discard, but he plays his last one from his hand. Yep. Now at least, at least Kanjo has to go away. Although, I still think it's crazy that, with access to uh, a Karmic Twist at least in his discard, he did not try to salvage that Prodigy of the Ways. Yeah. Of course, it's very easy to say those kinds of things when you're sitting over here. Yeah, when you see the full scope of. Your opponent's hand along with what's happening? Yeah, for sure. I'll be honest, I'm actually a little surprised he hold, held on to the library. Um, just with the yeah. amount of fate he has and first player, he could potentially look to just end the game. Here we go, the big boy himself. Tadaka. Nice. Get rid of that talisman. I like it. Just around the two third point here, so uh, it'll probably end soon. Yeah, I was thinking it might end this round, but I don't know that Zachary has quite enough in ammunition to close it out. Hmm. Does Zachary only have one card left in his dynasty deck? He does, but like the Ninos can just keep pooping in and out. So well, that's true, but I mean also. Ben has given him three years worth of honor, so yeah, he's got no shortage there. But I think that's why Ben wanted to go with honor because of all his cards like Unleash a Jin, yeah, um, Captive Audience, so that he doesn't get hit too much on it. Force of the River, unplayable at the moment, which is unfortunate, but it's going with water. Access to Ninos, but they both get access to Ninos. Yep. Zach just has a lot more cards in his hand. Such a weeny little boulder rider coming in. Yeah. I'm surprised uh, Zach didn't uh, sacrifice the um, Talisman. 
So you can't just send him over here. He may be thinking that he's got to get through more than one anyways. Right. So he's, he's just going to, like, let's just break that province and then go forward. Yes. I get it. And then forgets to use meditation again. I mean... So then uh, Shoto gets bowed. That's fine. Oh, yeah. Shoto might as well have been in the defense, though. Eh? Yeah. Ready up. Didn't ready, just waiting for Zach's action first. Okay. All right. Well, I oh, I get it, because Zach has access to against the waves during conflict, so you could just ready up these guys after. So yeah. we're gonna ready one. Yeah. So, for a three. Tetsuko something. Yeah, I don't know if there's any reason for um, Zach to invest, invest anything in the defense here. Yeah, I wouldn't play anything. I mean, I will display a power. Yeah. Uh, I don't think those are really. Yeah. All right. Well. I might have just gone for the cloud. Yeah. So he's not going to have a mystic next turn. Oh. Interesting. He just left it for this day and try to finish it off this turn. So go military fire, I think is what it is. Yeah. I mean, I'm surprised he didn't use it against the waves during that conflict to get. Uh, yeah. Didn't he declare military already? No, he did political and then he got rallied. Oh, rallied. Sorry. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> That hot Nino and Nino action. So that's the supernatural storm. Yeah, into Supernatural Storm. All right, that's game for Zach.